Hey everyone, uh, we're going to take a look at Last Blood, uh, Rambo Last Blood. Uh, hopefully this is Last Blood for Rambo. I, I don't think I could take another Rambo movie. Let's, this is a, just a teaser trailer, but let's check it out. That was the trailer for the trailer, by the way. is like retired Rambo. <laughs> Wasn't he in like, I don't know, the Philippines or something last time? Some fast with a bullet. Some not enough left to bury. All these years I've kept my secrets. Well, it's nice to know Rambo got to retire on a farm someplace uh, in the Midwest. But the time has come to face my past. And if it comes looking for me, they will welcome death. Well, it's good music. Um, I don't know. <laughs> uh, Sylvester Stallone, got a hand to the guy. He just keeps going on. I, I think the real tragedy with him is he's a really talented guy, a really good actor. I, I really liked him in Copland, and he played a character that was older and falling apart, and, uh, you know, it was an original concept, and, um, you know, it's a good movie. You know, the Rambo franchise, it's been over for a while. You know, the first one's really good. Um, you know, the ones after are kind of like, what are we doing here? Uh, you know, the, the, the whole story of... John, I mean, it's great to see a character in the first movie like John Rambo. He's just a random vet trying to, you know, he's really down on his luck and then he gets harassed and all this stuff happens. But, you know, all the subsequent movies are just murder fest I mean it's like so how many people can Sylvester Stallone murder this movie and you know I enjoy some action movies but uh again it's all about the story and the weight and there was a lot of weight on that first movie and the other movies just don't carry that it's you know each one just is a bigger and bigger spectacle it's like oh how big of a roller coaster can we build this time instead of like what can we do that's interesting or what we can reveal? So, uh, I don't know. This is not the kind of movie I would see in a theater pretty much under any circumstances. You know, I'll wait for the reviews, maybe watch it on Netflix if I'm really bored and just want some action, but it's not like I have to see this movie.